I think this is um, probably my favorite phone of the year. It's an all around solid device. And this is Google's Pixel 7 Pro. Pixel 7 Pro. Okay, so let's look at the overall hardware. And the Pixel 7 Pro has the best camera system of any smartphone right now. You have a 50 megapixel main camera. It had accurate colors, great exposure, sharp detail. 12 megapixel ultra wide lens. The ultra wide camera got an upgrade over last year. It now has a wider field of view. And then the telephoto, which is now up to 5X, which I love. There's Super Res Zoom, which combines software, hardware, and machine learning to get up to 30 times zoom. So you'll get better zoomed in shots. And the ultra wide camera doubles as a macro lens that works really well. It was great because it let me get really close to any item and capture them in great detail letting you get really close to your subjects. Google introduces a new cinematic mode this year, which tries to improve videography with much more aggressive bokeh effects whenever you record anyone. But what's responsible for all these great camera features is the new Tensor G2 chip. This is Google's second generation silicate. The Tensor was custom designed by Google to handle Google's AI algorithm. Tensor G2 also enables Google's uh, crazy good photo algorithm. What's super interesting is seeing how much computational photography goes into every shot that you take. There's a new photo on blur. So Google will analyze that photo and use its uh, AI wizardry to stitch together a new photo where the face is slightly in better focus. There's also Magic Eraser. This is not a new feature. It's been around since the Pixel 6 Pro. It allows you to remove unwanted elements from your photos. In case, it does do a reasonably good job of sharpening up. This is like the best overall phone in the world right now. You get one of the best cameras on a smartphone yet, super fast software updates, a big smooth screen, and incredible AI features that no other phone has.